Hi, I'm Dr. Robert Wright, I'm Professor of Pediatrics and Preventive Medicine at Icon School of Medicine at Mount Sinai, and I'm the director of the new NIEHS P30 Core Center. Hi, I'm Dr. Rosalind Wright. I'm the Vice Chair of Clinical and Translational Research and the Department of Pediatrics at Kravis Children's Hospital at the Icon School of Medicine at Mount Sinai in New York. My name is Dr. Maida Galvez. I'm a pediatrician, and I direct the Region 2 Pediatric Environmental Health Specialty Unit here at Mount Sinai. The center really builds on many of the uh, new initiatives at Mount Sinai has developed over the last decade. There's been a tremendous growth in research and the research infrastructure here at Mount Sinai. Uh, it's been particularly strong in the field of genomics and epigenomics. What we're trying to bring is the field of environmental health into these um, different new institutes that have been built here at Mount Sinai. The mission of the center is to take a holistic approach to understanding child health and child disease. Uh, we're not just interested in the chemicals that may be risk factors for these disorders. We're also interested in studying uh, nutritional factors and social factors that also may play into these disorders. Another aspect of the center is to establish in a more formal way these facility cores, which are really meant to catalyze or facilitate investigators coming from various uh, areas of scholarship to be able to more quickly conduct science across disciplines together. What starts even at conception in pregnancy during early childhood sets your trajectory already for what your risk is going to be as a 30, 40, 50 year old to develop chronic uh, cardiovascular disease, lung disease, what have you. As a pediatrician training in the South Bronx in East Harlem, I saw that a lot of the problems that our families faced were rooted in the community and in neighborhood. And I really wanted to work with scientists and public health officials and community members to think about what could we do together to try to prevent and reduce these exposures. Um, and these are environmental exposures like access to healthy foods, um, substandard housing, uh, pesticide exposure in the home, concerns about crime and safety, things that families in urban inner city neighborhoods face on a daily basis. Families today are often inundated with messages in the media about a wide range of environmental exposures from lead to pesticides to flame retardants to heavy metals. And it's often hard for families to know what to do about those exposures. The goal of the Mount Sinai Community Outreach Engagement Corps is to take those headlines and use the latest science to provide evidence-based, lay-friendly, actionable messages for families, particularly in at-risk communities.